This Father's Day, I like to thank my father for teaching me how to drive. I should have my license back in about five months. Hey Dad, happy Father's Day. I just wanted to apologize for that time that I uh, walked in on you with Mom. Uh, you know, you know, it was pretty weird for all of us. What's even weirder is that I went in my bedroom afterwards and totally punched one out. <laughs> <laughs> well, Dad, I guess I have you to thank for the small penis jeans. <laughs> got you this candle, and um, I got you some coupons. This this one's good for a free hug. Happy Father's Day, Dad. Show you my appreciation. I'm gonna let you show me your cum face. <laughs> I want to show my dad how much uh, I appreciate and love him by shouting HUSTLE at everybody I see just arbitrarily. I'm gonna go on Maury Povich and find out who my baby's daddy really is. GET IN THE GAME! Yeah, all those times we were playing catch outside, that was just kind of an excuse I used to let all my friends go in and gangbang Aunt Tracy. I'm sorry. <laughs> Father's Day, I'm gonna celebrate James Brown, the father of soul, because let's face it, I'm much less afraid of black people when they're dancing to a funky beat. Suck it up! By the way, your hand jobs are pretty weak. Get your head out of your ass! And while we're at it, we could celebrate Bill Dixon, the father of women's boxing, because, well, when women are beating the shit out of each other, it's a hell of a lot less work for this guy. I'm gonna fuck you so bad. <laughs> this year for Father's Day, I'm not going to resist the advances of Father McGinley. Well, no son of mine cries after he gets hit by a pitch, and, and, and why not bacon and eggs? Why apple cinnamon oatmeal? And, and, and real men wear eyeliner to the movies? Well, ah. screw him! <laughs> Dad, I wanted to tell you that the only thing I learned how to do in college was be a good wigger. So now we can open that wig store we always wanted to open. I thought it was a big cop-out that on a take your daughter to work day, you just locked me in my room with no clothes on and a webcam. <laughs> Father's Day, me and my dad like to sit around and reminisce about, you know, life lessons learned. Like that one time when he taught me the difference between a, a crooner and a chanteuse. Werner Von Braun, the father of the V2 rocket, because if this world has way too much of anything, it's the limey Brits. This year my dad says, you should have been a blowjob. I'm gonna pretend to hear, I love you. This Father's Day, race training. I'm just gonna become a father, and this time, the mother won't be my sister. I'm gonna follow Dad's example and treat everybody with equal respect. Except for the Mexicans. Isn't it weird that Father's Day falls on the anniversary of Pearl Harbor? I forgot to mention the Chinese. Remember that time that you found that pot in my sock drawer? And I told you it wasn't pot? And the Swiss. The Germans. Well, it wasn't. It was Grandmom's ashes. And they really fucked me up. Pretty much anybody from South America. And people from Kentucky. I'm gonna give you some hand-me-ups. So, uh... That's my red shirt, and, uh... This one's my blue shirt. Finally giving up understanding that show. My two dads. Okay, I admit it. I just don't get it, and I'm okay with that. And, uh... Well, this accident just graduated college! Thanks for nothing! Turn it off.